if you find yourself in a place where all your plans, all your dreams, everything seems to have fallen apart, I want to say to you, hold on. Sunday is coming. I have learned to celebrate my own scars as tattoos of triumph. Scars are proof that God heals. So often within our Christian communities, we hide who we really are from one another because we don't want to be judged. But we're not called to be perfect. I did that for years and it almost killed me. I pursued perfection with everything in me, but now I pursue Christ who is perfect. I don't know what your scars are. I don't know what you have been through. My scars are, you know, my father's death by suicide, my own struggles with mental illness. And I used to think I should hide that from people because of what they would think of me. But now I don't. I want to say to people, look what Jesus did. So whatever you have gone through, whatever you are going through, I encourage you to offer up those scars in an act of worship. You know, there's a difference between an open wound and a scar. We don't share our stories when they're still open wounds. But once God has done a deep work of healing, then we get to show one another 